got bloating after Thanksgiving, eat some dirt to reduce that bloating. No, I'm not actually telling you to eat dirt. But if you remember when you were a kid, you probably did eat some dirt, right? But we're gonna use that concept, right? What was in that dirt? It was good bacteria, right? So you want to, when you have the bloating, a lot of that gas is produced by your so-called bad bacteria. So you wanna input good bacteria to over, to, to control that bad bacteria from overgrowing. So what are good bacteria? Well, they're probiotics, right? You can get any type of probiotics. Um, I've got three different types right here. Now, which is the best probiotic it's the one that you take that's the best one right there is no single probiotic that's going to fix everything that's a lie it's a myth right you want to rotate your probiotics too much of a good thing can turn into a bad thing right so too much of a good bacteria can actually cause a bacterial infection into your intestines so make sure you rotate them all right get ready for christmas You got spine pain, you hurting from your neck all the way down to your lower back, well karate chop them away. We're gonna show you one karate chop that can help you instantly decrease that spine pain. So we're gonna use your, your pinky fingers right here, right? We're gonna use this part of your pinky finger. This top part actually corresponds to, top part corresponds to your neck, bottom part corresponds to your lower back, in between corresponds to your mid back. So you're going to karate chop them, okay? You're gonna karate chop and you're gonna keep on doing this, okay? And you're going to move your neck while you're doing it, move your back while you're doing it, and karate chop, and you're, start, you're gonna start feeling that pain start to decrease, right? Just karate chop, you can do it as long as you want, as long as you're, you don't hurt your hands, right? So let's do this in slow motion. Slow motion, karate chop. Okay, let's do it fast, back to, fast, okay. Karate chop, there's a link, follow me on YouTube, there's a link on my profile, click on that for more instructional videos. You want healthy breasts? Here's three exercises you have to do on a daily basis, right? So first, before we go over the exercises, breast health. It doesn't matter if it's men or women, but this is specifically great for women. Now, improve breast health, besides we look at hormone balance, we also want to look at something called your lymphatic system. The lymphatic system is the sewer system of your body. So imagine in a city, like here in Austin, Texas, let's say if the sewer system, if the sewer system got all clogged up, then all the sewer would come out onto the streets and we would have filth all over the streets, right? So how does that, you know, that's what happens when the sewer system gets clogged up. So imagine if our sewer system in our body gets clogged up, that's when you start, you know, having all these toxins accumulate, you know, tumors, cancer, and blah, 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 and so forth, right? That's what happens when the lymph system, which is our sewer system, gets clogged up. So we have a lot of lymph nodes right here in our armpits around our breast, right? So we want to make sure our lymph system is constantly flowing. So we're going to do three exercises. Exercise number one, all right? You're going to beat your chest, okay? Some people call this tapping. I like to call it beating, right? So you're going to beat your chest both chest, okay, because you got two breasts, all right? You're gonna beat both chests, you're gonna do it 50 times, all right? Now you can use a fist, like I'm doing right now, or you can use a cup, like you're cupping your hand like this, right? And you can cup like this, cupping just all around your breast. This helps circulate the lymph, okay? And the blood circulation, so it prevents any type of lymph blockage. Number two exercise, 
you're gonna slap those smelly armpits, right? Smelly armpits, you're gonna slap them 50 times. Smelly armpits, both sides, right? We have a lot of lymph nodes right here in the smelly armpit area. So you can slap them right here, okay? 50 times each time, each, 50 times each day, right? And the last one, you're gonna cook like a chicken, all right? You're gonna make sure you massage, you're gonna activate those all those lymph nodes, all the lymph nodes here by just doing the chicken, the chicken dance, okay? It's called the chicken dance. You can do the chicken da dance for 50 times also, and that will, again, speed up the circulation to all your lymphs, all right? So do these three exercises every single day to maintain your breast health and prevention of, of happening any type of disease, lymph nodes, clogs and so forth uh, to do these three every single day make sure you subscribe to my YouTube